Okay, let's have a look at the certificates module. Now, just bear in mind this is a third party piece of contributed code. It's not uh, part of a standard Moodle installation. So, you'll need somebody with uh, a certain level of expertise to install and configure and test uh, the module before you commit it to a production environment. But the idea is you come into a course when all is good, turn editing on as a teacher, and add an activity. It's called certificate. That's the sort of thing you're going to issue or have students uh, self-issue at the completion of a course or a discrete unit of study. So you give it a name and an introduction. You can actually notify teachers via email when certificates have been issued. Uh, we're going to save, say yes to save certificates and report certificates. You can also have dependent activities. So a student might need to complete an assignment uh, and to a satisfactory level uh, before you issue the certificate. You can uh, put in some other parameters too, as well as uh, you know the date. Uh, naturally, we might want to display the grade, credit hours and so forth. There's even space there for custom text. There's various design options, portrait and landscape, you know, images, borders, and you can choose your preferred watermark, signatures, seals, or logos. If, if you're not happy with the default, uh, ask your system administrator to upload um, your own images to the appropriate folders on the server. So when we're done, uh, we can save and return to course. So that is now, that certificate activity has been set up and it is the assignment is uh, dependent on it. Okay, so look, through the eyes of a student, let's give this, as a matter of fact, before we do, we'll set one other thing up. Um, and this is in modules, blocks, and sticky blocks. Happen to have installed a uh, related plugin uh, that will display, uh, I guess, reports site-wide for administrators and also show students um, how they're performing across their various courses. Now, I've gone into sticky blocks through the eyes of a system administrator um, and this is the My Moodle page. It's a personalised page that can get served up to students upon login. There's an additional block here we want to add. Once this has been installed and configured, it's called My Certificates. So we've got that there now. What we'll do, uh, we'll go back to the Sandpit course, but momentarily log in and see what's going on through the eyes of a student. Okay, so they come into the certificate. Let's presume they've done the assignment and to a satisfactory standard. They should be able to self-issue the certificate. It's PDF generated. That is all good. Uh, if the student were to navigate to their My Moodle page, which is really the URL of your Moodle forward slash MY, they should be able to see their certificates okay, that have been issued for the respective courses. Okay. Now, on the same token, an administrator can come in and view issued certificates site-wide. Okay, so that's for uh, the various courses and the students in those various courses. So it's sort of a snapshot of overall performance and attainment on one page uh, for your administrator. So there you have it.